I might want it a little harder because it's for using to be used for cutting and I'm not, I'm not going to be able to apply an impact force to this knife like I would a big knife. Then something like a tomahawk needs to be a completely different steel because it needs to be way tougher than it is hard. All right. And we'll get into that balance here in a minute. But when I talk about what's the best steel, it has to be the best steel for the purpose. Okay. So follow with me there. There's going to be the best steel for cutting. There's going to be the best steel for chopping. There's going to be the best steel for a collecting or collector's display knife. There's going to be the best steel for maritime environments with salt water. There's going to be the best steel for the jungle. There'll be a best steel for a combat zone. There'll be a best steel for an everyday carry knife if you're in Arizona or a dry, hot temperature area, okay? If you're in a humid environment, then there might be another best EDC knife for you. If you're using it as a kitchen knife or a slicer, then it's going to be a different steel.